all right welcome back to the channel today we're going to be watching lord of the rings and the return of the king extended edition now we're already on the third movie which is pretty surprising honestly because each movie was like three hours and 30 minutes so far and so oh wait no this one's four hours and 23 minutes holy shit holy shit well okay when do the credits start because th there's a good like 25 minutes of credits in every movie okay they start out at four hours and one minute so we got four hours oh my god okay well i'm excited because the last movie the two towers it had a very good cliffhanger it had a very good cliffhanger in it right now okay so Gollum, he's gonna betray frodo and sam he's gonna betray them because apparent because master frodo betrayed Gollum, and now Gollum's like really hurt and everything so so that's Gollum's intentions now right he said i'll let her do it or he said we could let her do it i don't know who this her is supposed to be i don't know who he's talking about i'm sure we'll find out but then as far as like aragorn and gandalf and all of them they defeated the orcs they defended helm's deep from the orcs so that was pretty nice and then pip and mary they got the ends to isengard and they destroyed Sorman's work they destroyed everything he was working on so i don't know what he's gonna do to like bounce back from this all shit's destroyed so anyways i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this movie if you'd like to watch the full length reaction that'll be available on patreon as well early there's no early access because this is the last movie so let's get started oh smeagol oh smeagol oh we're about to learn his backstory okay okay Boy, you gotta let go of that. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. This is how Schmeagel found the ring. Brother found it underwater. Guessing it's his brother. They have like really similar names. Yeah, and that's Schmeagel because that's Andy Circus. Hmm. But don't tell me he kills his brother over the ring. That'd be, that'd be so sad. Oh! Oh, he's killed him. He's killed him. Damn. Oh, no. Damn. So, yeah, as soon as he saw the ring, he just took him over immediately. Didn't even hold it and then just controlled it, you know? Seduced him before he even hold it, held it. Precious. Okay, he talks the same too before he like turned into a golem. Totally just physically transformed him. Just took over his entire life. That should be enough. For what? The journey home. Come on, it's Frodo probably hasn't even thought about the journey home because, you know, it's like he's probably, he's probably gonna have to die in the process to destroy the ring. And he's probably accepted that. So if it'll cost him his life to destroy the ring, I think he'll, I think he'll do it. The return of the king. Yep, flooded. So where's Sorman? Is he still in the tower up there, or is he dead? But there is a wizard to manage here. Look to his tower. Okay, he's still here then. Even in defeat, Saruman is dangerous. We need him alive. We need him to talk. Can we not take counsel together as we once did, my old friend? Nah. When you answer for the burning of the Westfold and the children that lie dead there, when you hang from a gibbet, mm. thousands more are now at risk. But you could save them, Saruman, deep in the enemy's council. So you have come here for information. Mm-hmm. Obviously, that's why you're alive. Something festers in the heart of Middle Earth. Something that you have failed to see, even now. He presses his advantage. His attack will come soon. Okay. You're all going to die. 
So are you. You cannot think that this ranger will ever sit upon the throne of Gondor. Crept from the shadows will never be crowned king. Yes, he will. Tell me, what words of comfort did you give the halfling before you sent him to his doom? Come down, Saruman, and your life will be spared. Mm, I believe Gandalf. I have no use for it! <laughs> Bro, he's fine, he's fine, he's fine. Yeah, I see that. Your staff is broken. Damn, dude, yeah, that was so powerful now. You need not follow him. I hope we kill Grima. You were once a man of Rohan. Man of Rohan. Watch him push him off. The victory at Helm's Deep does not belong to you. Come down. Be free of him. Free? He will never be free. Yeah, he's gonna kill him. He's gonna kill Grima. Tell us what you know. Oh, oh, Grima. Grima. Yeah, he's dead. Someone's gonna kill him. Hell, prisoner here. Oh, no fucking way. What? Oh, shit. And, and Grima? Wait, so they both die? What? Wow, okay. Oh, Okay, yeah, he's for sure dead. Send word to all our allies. And to okay, I thought like Swordman was gonna just like turn around and just like disarm him and then kill him, you know, but like, nah. <laughs> hey, we should get, we should collect that. We should grab that. We can definitely see what he was talking about with that. Pippin! Oh, Pippin's gonna grab it. Yes. I'll take that, my lad. Quickly now. It was not Théoden of Rohan who led our people to victory. It was him. I feel something. <laughs> she was drunk. A slight tingle in my fingers. Okay, I don't think you're drunk. I think you're drugged. I think you're roofied. Pippin! Yeah, why is Pippin looking at Gandalf like that? When he handed Gandalf the thing... You give him a weird look and right there too. Could have been affected by it when he picked it up. Every day Frodo moves closer to Mordor. Do we know that? That Frodo is alive? Yes, he's alive. Dog in your sleep. Okay. okay, I thought one of them were gonna wake up and hear him talking in his sleep. Smeagol wants to see him. Dead. But did it once. Mm -hmm. He can do it again. His brother, yep. It's us. We must get it back. Patience, my love. <laughs> we must lead them to a star. Okay. Us, the stars. And the... Up the stairs we go. You tunnel. There's no coming out. She's always on. She always needs to feed. He gets his filthy oxes. And then okay, is it like a okay? It's like a pet or something, like a dragon. <laughs> oh, oh. Sam's Sam's gonna hear. And take it for me. Okay, he's talking hella loud too. Well, well, the hobbit says hard. Oh, oh, oh. oh shit! Alone. I heard it from his own mouth. He makes the murder us. Smeagol wouldn't have to fly. Call me a liar. You're a liar. Ah. Oh. You scared me. We're lost. I don't. Yeah, we still need him for directions, but he's leading us into a trap. He's a villain. By ourselves, Sam. Not without a guide. Come, Smeagol. <laughs> Ooh, look at that dirty ass look he gave Sam. I mean, I get Sam's POV of just Smeagol, of like hating Gollum and everything, because you know he's he's an op really. Like, and Sam literally just heard him say he's gonna kill them <laughs> and stuff. And like, Sam's super protective over Frodo, so I get it. But then I also get Frodo's perspective where he's like, no, we need the guide, even though there's no he's walking us into a trap. 
but it's like still we need somewhat of a guide to because like if he were to leave right now i would not know which way to go to get anywhere so it's like okay run you can and i feel like he's just gonna break her damn hard like she's gonna like like he knows she likes him he has to know dude he has to know and I feel like he's just kind of friend zoning her. Like he's he's there for her, but he's like nothing more, nothing more, just friends, platonic. Because you know he has that thing with Arwen, but he thinks Arwen already left. He knows Arwen already left, I guess. But I feel like he's just kind of it's like I'm not ready for that yet. But it didn't really confirm if Arwen actually left or not. Like it, like she was conflicted when she was talking to her dad. So if she didn't leave, and he sees Arwen, he's leaving her. He's like see ya to that girl. <laughs> That's gonna crush her, dude. <laughs> oh, he's just sleeping. Damn. Yeah, what are you doing? You're trying. Why are you trying to take it from him, bro? How would your eyes not, dude? Your eyes would get so dry if you're sleeping with your eyes open. Are you mad? I just want to look at it. Ooh. You see that? Mm -hmm. I see you. He's brought sore on here. Oh, he can't let go. Help! Got no. oh. <laughs> me. What did you see? There was a white tree. It was dead. I saw him. I could hear his voice in my head. What did you tell him about Frodo and the ring? A fool, but an honest fool. He remains. All right, all right. Old Sauron, nothing of Frodo and the Ring. Okay, okay, thank God. Sauron moves to strike the city of Minas Tirith. He knows the heir of Elendil has come for Men are not as weak as he supposed. He will raise Minas Tirith to the ground before he sees a king return to the... Rohan must be ready for war. Why should we ride to the aid of those who did not come to ours? Because it's the right thing to do. <laughs> we owe Gondor. Because if they lose, then it's one last ally for us to fight them. So it directly affects us if we don't help them. So we're going alone. Always have to look. I don't know. I can't help it. You never. I'm sorry. All right. I won't do it again. You probably will. Understand. Maybe not, you know, that, but you'll do something like that. He's going to be looking for you, Pip. You're coming with me. Mary, come on. Yeah, Mary is so mad. Uh, Pip's negligence. And you better hope we don't have one of those on our tail. Something for the road. Damn, he's not going. But we'll see each other soon. <sighs> we'll... Uh, I don't know if we will. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Oh. Mary! <laughs> That's sad. Best friend split apart. He's always followed me. Since before we were twins, but I was always there to get him out. Now you can't be there for him now. Okay, here we got Arwen. Hmm. She's imagining her son. She's imagining him with their child. How happy they could be. Dude, I'm, I'm calling her. She's not going. She's not going. She wants to live that life with Aragorn. There's nothing for you here. Yes, there is. There is something for me. Damn. It's so sad. We cannot delay. Oh! She's going back. She's going back. Damn, that's a great shot. Tell me what you have seen. You have the gift of foresight. I looked into your future and I saw death. There is also life. You saw there was a child. You saw my son. If I leave him now, I will regret it forever. Mm-hmm. It is time. Good for you. Huge shall be blade that was broken. The crownless again shall be king. Mm-hmm. We're gonna make our Aragorn king. We're making him king in this movie. The life of the Eldar is leaving you. Already? This was my choice. There is no ship now that can bear me yet. Mm-hmm. 
Sucks for the dad though, because he, he knows she's gonna die on me. Just passed into the realm of Gondor. Yep, that's the tree. Just In fact, it's better if you don't speak at all. But... Yeah, just shut the fuck up. Okay, don't don't say a word. <laughs> and with counsel. How does he know? To explain this. Ooh. You come to tell me why my son is dead. He died honorably. At least, you know. Boromir died to save us. He failed defending us from many foes. Mm hmm Oh, okay, Pippin. This is my first command to you. Bring me the How ring. How did you escape oh. and my son did not? So mighty a man as he was. Because he died protecting us. One arrow. And Boromir was pierced by many. Mm-hmm. War is coming. As steward, you are charged with the defense of this city. Where are Gondor's armies? Light the beacons. You think you are wise, Mithrandir? All right, cool. We tried to help you. Do you think the eyes of the White Tower are blind? Healed against Mordor, and with your right, you'd seek to supplant me. Who who rides with their dinner of Rohan? There we go. Word has reached my ears of this Aragorn, son of mm. Arathorn, and I. Authority is not given to you to deny the mm. return of the king, steward. Oh. All of Gondor is mine, and no others. All right, my boy got a little bit of an ego. Now, the whim of a madman, it will fall. Tough. Will fall because of one man's ego. The rule of Gondor was given over to lesser men. Oh, shit, damn. It's right there. Mordor. Yes, there it lies. Very close to Gondor. This is not the weather of the world. When the shadow of Mordor reaches this city, it's wraps. It will begin. Very impressive. So where are we off to next? Oh, it's too <laughs> oh, There's God. no leaving this city. Oh. Oh. Help must come to us. Oh, okay. Well, that's lint. So we, we're banking on Frodo doing this. Just a feeling. I don't think I'll be coming back. Yep. You will. Of course you will. We're going there and back again. Honestly, I think Frodo dies. I think he dies doing it. Come on, Hobbits! Mustn't stop now, this well! So I imagine this is just a ceremonial position. <laughs> oh no, we'll be using that. We'll be using everything right here. Frodo and Sam. There never was much hope. Just <laughs> a fool's hope. Damn. Our enemy is ready. Full strength gathered. Not only orcs, but men as well. That's right. If the garrison at Osgiliath falls, the last defense of this city. Sauron has yet to reveal his deadliest servant. The, the one they say no living man can kill. Which king of Angmar? You've met him before. Hmm. He stabbed Frodo on Weathertop. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, this guy, okay. He is the Lord of the Nazgul. Minas Morgul is his lair. Wait, I feel like that's where Gollum's taking them. Into murder. Hmm. A secret stab. Damn, that is steep as hell. Oh no. Oh no, he's uh he can't control it. They're calling me. Okay, whoa, whoa. Oh yeah, damn, they can see it. Wait, is that just alert uh the Nazul? Did that just trigger Sauron to send his army? Ooh, a dragon. Yeah, wait, is that the guy? Yeah, it is. Okay, okay, okay. We're in his lair. The Witch King. He's probably like, who the fuck? I can feel his blade. Mm hmm. He's already pierced you once. He can do it at last. 
All right, did trigger it. All right, we're going. Okay, I feel like what makes this guy unkillable by men is he could probably see. He probably has 20-20 vision. The other ones can't see for shit. Like they're already really raw. They're already raw fighting and everything. Like they're literally assassins, but they, they just can't see, or they could just barely see, you know. But I feel like the main guy, the Witch King, he he has perfect vision. So the so that's the difference. Up, up, up the stairs we go, and then it's into the tunnel. Hey, up the stairs we go, and then what's in this tunnel? You listen to me. You listen good and proper. It happens to him. You have me to answer to. Back of my head. It's over. Does Sam kill Gollum? I don't think so. What was that about? Nothing. I'm just clearing something up. If the orcs attack from the north, we'll... They're here. Kill him. They're not coming from the north. Nope. There you go, Faramir. I really like Faramir. I hope he survives. Come on. There you go. The beacon of Amundin is lit! Let everyone know. Gunnuckles for eight! What do you do? How, you, you... And Rohan will answer. Let's go. We ride for Gondor and war. Mm-hmm. See, I knew he'd come through. I knew it. The men have found their captain. They will follow you into battle, even to death. You have given us hope. Excuse me. I have a sword. Please accept it. I offer you my service. Oh. Gladly, I accept it. Before the walls of Minas Tirith, the doom of our time be decided Ooh, we're, we're losing this battle right now we're we are losing there's too many orcs Ooh. okay okay that was a great setup on the orcs chasing faramir and around the corner right there be right the minutes today gonna oh oh r.i.p the age of men is over of the orc has come that's what you think <laughs> oh okay what's getting about to do oh <laughs> Okay. That was a really cool trial of him riding out there, like to come save everyone really quick. And like you knew he's gonna you know he's gonna do something. You just don't know what exactly. And that was pretty sick. They broke their defenses. They've taken the bridge in the west bank. Long has he foreseen this doom. Foreseen mm. and done nothing. Yeah. So why are you gonna listen to him? Hmm. Mm. First halfling to have crossed your path. You've seen Frodo and Sam? Yeah, I was about to say, but I saw the subtitle. Not two days ago, they're taking the road to the Mobile Bale. And then the pass of Kirith Ungo. Yeah, you, you, you can't. What does that mean? It's a very dangerous path. Tell me all you know. This is how you would serve your city. You would risk its utter ruin. <sighs> Sent the ring of power into Mordor in the hands of a witless halfling. Back to the citadel to be kept safe. Dark and deep in the vaults. Not to be used. At the uttermost of need. I would not use the ring. Boromir would have remembered his father's need. Bro. Boromir would not have brought the ring. Yep. Stretched out his hand to this thing and taking it, he would have fallen. You know nothing of this matter. He would have kept it for his own. When he returned, you would not have known your son. But I'm here with mm -hmm. Doesn't matter. You will... My son. 
Oh, hmm. uh, he thinks he sees Boromir. Oh, uh, that's so heartbreaking for Faramir. Because he wants his father to act that way towards him, but no. Nah. Leave me. Alright. Careful. Very far to fall. Very dangerous on the stairs. Come, Master. Oh. To go on. Don't snatch it. Don't snatch it. Oh, okay, he got his hand, he got his hand, okay. Fat one cannot know. Smeagol look after Master. He needs it. Smeagol no. sees it in his eye. Trying to get Frodo to... He will ask you for it. The fat one will take it. Smart, that's a smart play by Smeagol, that's a smart play. Because now Frodo is, is second-guessing Sam. Get his attention off me about taking the ring, put it on Sam. That's a good play. Where Rohan's army come. Bro, they, I feel like it's it's gonna take a while to get there. Courage is the best defense that you have now. Like I don't know how far away they are, like how far away they are from each other. Like I I haven't seen a map or anything, but like I'm assuming it's gonna take like like it's probably gonna take them at least a day to get there. I think you have strength of a different kind, and one day your father will see it. Not yield the river in Pelennor and fort. Osgiliath must be retaken. My lord, Osgiliath is overrun. Must be risked. In war. It's not a good risk. There are a captain here who still has the courage to do his lord's will. You wish now that our places had been exchanged, that I had died and Boromir had lived. I wish that. Since you were robbed of Boromir, I will do what I can in his stead. Kills Faramir on the inside. Think better of me, father. That will depend on the manner of your return. Dude, I really don't like his dad. <laughs> I really don't like him. Faramir is going to approve. His quality to him. I already I know it. He has to, dude. He has to. <laughs> dude, how would you be able to sleep that close to the edge? I, okay, maybe we're saying this, but Frodo, hell no. You actually turn in your sleep, you're you're falling off. Hmm. Hmm. We have to be moving on. Damn, look at Frodo's eyes. Always dark here. I mean, Sam's eyes. They're both pretty dirty. Oh, yeah. It's gone. The elven bread. That's all we have left. He took it. He must have. What did you do with it? He doesn't eat it. He can't have taken yep. it. Yeah, yep. get him out of each other. What's this? Crumbs on him. Set him up. Oh, he's stuck. That's a filthy lie. <gasps> oh. Oh, 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 oh. Stop. Oh. I'll get it. Uh. Sam, no. Oh, my. I'm sorry. Here, just rest a bit. No. No, you're no, not. No, Frodo's drained, dude. It's that thing around your neck. Oh. Oh. I could carry oh. it for a while. No. I could carry it. I could carry it. Share the load. Share the load. I mean, it's jet. <sighs> I don't want to keep it. I mean, I feel like Sam, Sam's, Sam's obviously being genuine. He's trying to take. <sighs> Shut up, you! And it's exactly what Smeagol told him he told Frodo he Sam would do, so. It's you. Oh my god. Poison you against me. Mm-hmm. You can't help me anymore. Go home. Mm. Bro, I mean that's how the hell is Sam supposed to go home all the way by himself? <laughs> but no way Sam actually goes. There's no way. He may not go with Frodo and Schmeagol anymore, but like, he'll he'll still be on, I feel like. Damn. Yeah, that was smart by Schmeagol, too. Get Sam to get mad about the bread, and then that's why he drew, put all the crumbs on him and stuff. And it worked. Schmeagol's plan's working. But there's no way Sam actually leaves. I feel like he'll just kind of follow from, like, a distance, maybe. Because, like, dude, okay, you're literally, like, 95% there. I'm not going home if I'm Sam. I'm too. I've got. I've came too far to go home. No. Faramir, your father's will has turned to madness. Mm-hmm. Do not throw away your life so rash. Where does yeah. my allegiance lie? Not here. I'm glad to give my life to defend her beauty. Yeah, but like. <sighs> your father loves you, Faramir. I mean, that just shows you how badly Faramir wants to prove his quality to his father. He knows there's a great chance he's gonna die, but he's, he's gonna do it anyway. Come, sing me a song. 
but I mean, that's what you're supposed to do as like a soldier. But then again, like the king strategy may not, not the, really the best. So Gandalf tried to tell him, be like, look, you don't want to go out like this, but hey, but you're throwing away your life if you do this. So again, so. That was a good song, Dr. Devin. It's a nice voice. Yeah. Less than half of what I'd hoped for. 6,000 will not be enough to break the lines of Mordor. More will come. Every hour lost hastens Gondor's defeat. Then we must ride. Mm-hmm. Can't wait too long. The men are quiet. I grow nervous in the shadow of the mountain. Where is that? That is the road to the dim hole, the door under the mountain. None who venture there ever return. See where we're going on it? I do not doubt his heart, only the reach of his arm. Why should Mary be left behind? He has as much cause to go to war as you. Yeah, I mean, you should give him the right to do it at least, but he knows little of I'd, say, I'd say his chance of surviving is very low. And the horror of battle take hold. Do you think he would stand and fight? He would flee, and he would be right to do so. Oh, it's Arwen. Is that Arwen? I choose a mortal life. Mm-hmm. He's dreaming about her. I wish I could have seen him. One last time. Ooh. Oh, it's her dad. Survive the evil that now spreads from Mordor. How long has she got? Tar is failing. It is now tied to the fate of the ring. All right, we gotta do this. The end has come. It will not be our end, but his. Mm hmm. The right to war, but not to victory. <sighs> but in secret, he sends another force which will attack from the river. A mm hmm. Ooh. Sails from the south. You're outnumbered. You need more men. There are none. Dwell in the mountain. You would call upon them to fight. They believe in. They answer to no one. I mean, bro, we're pretty answer desperate. To the king of Gondor. Ooh. ooh. Yeah, he, cause he's the king. He's the rightful king. Forgotten sword of Elendi. The blade. Who can wield the power of this sword? Can summon to him an army more deadly than any that walks this earth? Become who you are born to be. Exactly, yes. Take the dim old road. You yeah, got you have to. If anyone's gonna survive, it's gonna be him. The war lies to the east. You cannot leave on the eve of battle. You cannot abandon the men. Uh I'm doing I'm doing a little side quest, so we have a better chance of winning. Why have you come? Do you not know? Yeah, because she's in love with him. I cannot give you what you seek. Damn, just broke her heart. Where do you think you're off to? This time you must stay, Gimli. Have you learned nothing of the stubbornness of dwarves? You might as well <laughs> accept it. We're going with you, laddie. Alright, fine. Pretty good backup, pretty good backup, you know. The king's like, where the fuck are you going? He doesn't know what he's gonna go and do. Why does he leave on the eve of battle? No, he kind of looks like a coward. He leaves because he must. Too few have defeated the armies of Mordor. He cannot, but we will meet them in battle nonetheless. Mm-hmm, they'll come through. He'll, they'll come through to come and help us. I have faith. The people are to follow your rule in my stead. She's probably gonna die in the battle, to be honest. Long ago, the men of the mountain swore an oath to the last king of Gondor, to come to his aid, to fight. When Gondor's need was dire, they fled. So Isildur cursed them, never to rest, until they had fulfilled their pledge. When they can fulfill it now. I do not fear death. Hmm. And Arwen's dad said that this army will, they'll listen to the king of Gondor, you know, and they gave him the sword and everything. So Aragorn, he's the true king of Gondor, but in order for him to like, but technically he's, technically like he's not king of Gondor as of right now. 
Like, he doesn't have to label officially yet. So, the current king, Faramir Boromir's dad, he's gonna have to die. Or, so I'm curious to know what happens with that. I doubt he just yields and gives up the position. No way, no chance. Could they just boot him out of it? Like, everyone around him be like, yeah, we don't want you to be our king. Ooh. Oh, shit, she picked him up. Okay, let's go. There's gonna be a little conflict going on just with that in of its own. Cause no way the current king yields to Aragorn. There's no way. Jesus fuck. There's so many. Oh my god, there's so many orcs. The dead are following. Let it go, Legolas! Hmm. Mm hmm. Uh, a bunch of schools. Yeah, everyone who's entered from you know. What? Subtitle said King of the Dead. Yep, that guy. One who will have your allegiance. The dead do not suffer the living to pass. You will suffer me. <laughs> now you must die. Yeah, it just goes right through them. They're, they're dead. They're ghosts. To fulfill your oath. None but the King of Gondor may command me. That's me, and this yep, sword proves it. Ah! Yeah, but he could fight them with the sword. Pride was broken. Oh. It has been remade. No, actually, he grabbed him too. So, fight for us and regain your honor. What say you? I'm guessing he's the only one that can grab him because he's the king. Like everyone else, will just go right through him. And that he has the sword too, so he can grab him. Cause like. Legolas's arrow went right through him. So if they fight for us like this, they can strike us. Like, they can strike someone else. But no one else can strike against them. That's so OP. <laughs> We're gonna win then. Because <laughs> we literally can't be killed. Fight, and I will release you from this living death! Stun, you traitors! Mm, that's why they have no honor. God damn, there's so many schools. Yeah! Jesus, it's like it literally looks that literally looks like popcorn. Alright, well that was a good try, I guess. That would have been pretty nice if they agreed, but Oh, oh. Oh yep. Just like he told him. Oh. Bat, let's go. Oh, uh, is this Faramir? Oh my god, he's the only one that survived. This horse broke. No, he's not, he's not, he's probably not even alive, actually. He's the only one that made it back. Like, his horse brought him back. That was such a dumb plan by his father. Like, what the fuck? Faramir? Oh, now you care about him. They were outnumbered. Yeah, it was never going to work. I'm shocked Faramir even made it back. Like his horse dragged him back and I'm shocked that even happened. Release the prisoners. Get them up. Oh, they better just send all the dead. Oh my God. The heads of all the soldiers. Wow. Damn, Faramir's actually dead. R.I.P. Oh, never mind. He needs medicine, my lord. My line has ended. Watch, he thinks his lines that he's gonna jump off, huh? Yeah, but now he sees all this. Oh my god! That aerial shot really put it in perspective how much they have. Has deserted us. <laughs> they're on the way, but. Betrayed me. No, they're on the way. Like, Theoden and all of them are gonna show up any time, but I don't know about Aragorn. Aragorn's the gonna come. What? Please hey. save my Bruh. See, because he knows we're gonna. Oh, yeah, you dummy. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Prepare for battle. <laughs> yes. Finally. Finally, a real leader to step up and lead us. Ooh. 
Yeah, why don't we just catapult all the fucking collateral damage they cause? Like, now we have all, all these rocks to send back at them. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's literally what they did. Oh, I mean, it's heavy as shit. So it, might, it would take a, a while to get all into the catapult. I get that. But still. Oh. Land right on him. Right there. Yes. Right there. Just him alone. Oh, I moved. Fuck. <laughs> oh, dude. The dragons. The Nazul and the dragons. That's a fucking problem, dude. Dude, I gotta pee so bad, but I don't want to stop watching this. Hey, at least they're not breathing fire on us. Jesus, but yeah, that's still pretty fucking devastating. Oh my god. Protect it. Come on, come on, get off. This is no place for a hobbit. There you go. Good stuff. Guard of the Citadel, indeed. Mm-hmm. Proud of you, Pip. I'm proud. I know Mary's gonna have a kill like that, too. Okay, look, look, look. If we can kill enough of the orcs before they break down the door... It's too strong! Yeah, if, they could, if we could kill enough, the bodies will just pile up, and then they'll be blocking it for us, too. But nothing can reach it! Run, through breach it. Oh, uh, the big, the big giant. Ooh, oh, uh, this guy right here. Okay, this contraption. I thought he meant like one of these big guys, but no, this contraption. Oh no, that's Grand. Okay. You may go no further. <laughs> you will not enter Gondor. <laughs> Who are you to deny us passage? The king. Fire a warning shot past the. Bur <laughs> oh shit. We warn you. Prepare to be warned! Are you a army? The dead army. This army. Mm-hmm. Christ, you must go inside the tunnel. I don't think I want to. <laughs> it's the only way. I'll go back. You can't go back. Smeagol! Hmm. That's a spider's lair. So. Yeah, he needs his buddy. He needs his best friend. Is he did he realize Smeagol just set him up in the trap? <laughs> Damn, Sam Sam's really going home. Wow. A bread it can be his motivation to go back for Frodo. He just realized Smeagol threw it off. He set him up on purpose. So he knows for sure Smeagol's lying. He's like, I'm going back. I give you the light of Erendi, our most mm. beloved star. May it be a light for you in dark places. Perfect. Jalima! Ooh, oh, it's a big ass spider. Try the light. Oh. Sir, you will be Oh, oh, yeah, fuck the sword. I'm getting, yeah. Ooh. Motherfucker. But away did it, precious. Not this time! You must believe us! It was the precious! The most doing it! First stop, because he feels pity, feels empathy, empathy for him. I have to destroy it, Smeagol. I have to destroy it for both our sakes. Mm-hmm. Oh shit! No, no, no! Did he just die? No, 
dude, I re ah, I really hope that wasn't Gollum's death. I like him a lot as a character. It's elf. This task was appointed yes. to you, Frodo of the Shire. If you do not find a way, no one will. Yep, there's his motivation to keep on going. Dig deep, Frodo. Dig deep. I'm a hobbit. And I know I can't save Middle Earth. I just want to help my friends. Mm hmm. Frodo. Yeah. Sam. You want to contribute any way you possibly can. To battle. To battle. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, this is a strong ass door. This is a strong ass door, first of all. Oh yeah, just be ready with the archers, right? Because you know that door's breaking down eventually. Just be ready. Gondor is lost. There is no hope for men. But there is. This king is a very pessimistic. Okay, I do apologize for calling him the king. I didn't know he was not the king. I just assumed he was because he was the one in charge sitting on a throne. He's only the caretaker of the throne and Gondor hasn't had a king in years. And that makes sense. I was wondering why he was sitting on the smaller throne next to the larger one, but this answers my question for that. So, so I apologize for calling him the king. I just didn't know. He's like so secluded in his own like little world in his head. You know, like, like everything's about him, you know? Like he didn't even really care that Faramir died. He cared more about, he cared more about the fact that his line was broken more than Faramir actually dying. <laughs> Like he, he's just worried about himself. But come through that gate, you will stand your ground. Dude, the spire is so quiet. Damn. Not making a single sound. <laughs> oh, 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 fuck, I got him. Oh, shit. Sam, yes, yeah, Sam, yep, so. Let him go, you filth. Come on and finish it. Come on, Sam. Ooh, oh. Ooh. Got your ass. Mm. Good stuff, Sam. Good stuff. Ooh. Oh, is he dead? There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way he dies like that. There's no way. Don't go where I go. Follow. Dead. Oh, there's orcs. There's orcs. Yeah, he's alive. This fellow ain't dead. Yep. Get him to the tower. He's not dead. He's not dead. Yeah, no, he's not. Yeah, they're about to burn Faramir anyway. Go now and die in what way seems best to you. Bro, fuck off. On, Bro, I know Pippin's gonna save him. Pippin's gonna save Faramir. Yeah, he's getting Gandalf. But Gandalf is, I was gonna say, go get Gandalf, but he's extremely busy right now. He has something a little bit more important going on, so. Oh, okay, yeah, okay, he's going, he's going, never mind. Oh, he's just gonna point his staff at this dragon. Oh, it's the Witch King. This is my power. I got Gandalf. I got Gandalf still. Oh, never mind. Never mind. You have failed. The world of men will fall. Nah. They're here. It was go. <laughs> I love the music too. 
right now. Oh my god, there's so many orcs. <laughs> Courage, Mary. Courage for our friends. Mm hmm. Oh, but she's so nervous. I mean, our army is pretty fat too, but theirs is definitely. They definitely got more. Hey, but we're fresh. They're they might they're a little fatigued because they've been fighting. We're completely fresh, so that's our advantage right now. Yeah, yeah, once we collide though, once we collide. <laughs> Bro, it's like a car crash when that happens. Oh my god, these horses are just running them down. <laughs> Love to see it. Bro, is he about to burn himself too? Yeah, I think. Yeah, bro, this fool's clearly alive, but. But the king's just in so much denial, he does not care. Because I guess, you know, he plans to go out too, so... Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Tremendous. There is no victory. Mm. Bro, this was a psycho. Yeah, stab his ass. Oh. No, I just whack him. Come on, Pippin. Yes! Yes. <laughs> oh yeah, and the king dies anyway. Yeah. Oh my god, bro! Why did this kid? <laughs> why did he just age like? Oh, he jumped off. Holy! I mean, yeah. If you're on fire, i yeah. I, I guess you might as well. But dude, Gandalf looked like he just aged like 30 years. <laughs> The lighting did not do him justice. Drive them to the river! Oh, his face. He, he's worried now. <sighs> yep, they pulled up in the Oliphants. Yeah, they're about to just run us over. This is gonna be bad. <laughs> You know, the ones who go directly under them, they're gonna, they're dead. But the ones who get the uh, ride right beside the Oliphants could just take their spear and slash the ankles out. Oh my god. Oh my, yeah, good luck. Uh. Yeah, and like the tusk, I think that's what they're called, are just taking so many people out. Bro, oh, this is just chaos. Yes, yes, get them to collide, yes. I was just about to say, if you can get them to r collide into each other, that's how you gotta take them out. Like, as the first one started to wobble, I was gonna say it, but then it happened, so. Oh, she's putting it at work. Didn't think it would end this way. It's not gonna. Yeah. Oh, the journey doesn't end here. Death is just another path. Hmm. One that we all must take. And then you see it. White shores. Well, that isn't so bad. No, it isn't. And it just help to uh, accept the idea of death a little bit more, you know? <laughs> Damn! <sighs> okay, he's not dead. He's not dead. He's probably extremely hurt, but he's not dead. Oh. I will kill you if you touch him. Mm hmm Come between the Nazgul and his prey. Love the bravery. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, she's about to cut his head. Oh, pfft. she cut his fucking head off. The dragon. Yep, go toe to toe with the Witch King. <laughs> uh, I love the bravery. I do. I really do. But. Watch Aragorn pull up right here, too. Like, this is... And the king can't even do anything because he's too injured. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, she got hit. As usual, pirates. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's plenty for the both of us. <laughs> yeah, oh my god. Oh, it's too easy. It's too easy for the for the army of the dead. Oh my god. No man can kill me. I feel like Aragorn's gonna be the one to kill him, to be honest. Because he's the king and he has the sword. Oh, oh. Mary! Oh fuck. Alright, cut his head off. Cut his head off right here. Come on. I am no man. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yes! Ooh. It's like a black hole. He's just... All right. Good shit. Proud of her. Very proud. Her bravery did that. Come on, Aragorn. Save her. Ooh. Yes! He's taking it out. If anyone is, it's him. Oh. <laughs> okay, now what does the Olyphant do? Is it just gonna run away? Or does he kill it? Oh yeah, he has to kill it. Uh, that's that's still sad though, like Alright, so what we got like seven more to kill now? <laughs> that still only counts as one! <laughs> I figured Aragorn would be the one that killed the Witch King because like they hyped them up pretty nicely to be like, no man can kill him. It's like impossible. But then Aragorn is the only one that's able to do it because, you know, just the story they're trying to tell with him is that he is that guy. He is him. So that would have been pretty cool to see. But it was also really cool to see like her do it, give that line. But it was a great moment when Eowyn did it. So I'm happy with it. My body is broken. Mm hmm. You have to let me go. Oh. Uh. R.I.P. for the king. Damn, so okay, we won. Shit. Release us. Bad idea. Very handy in a tight spot. No, they came through like they were supposed to. That's part that was part of the deal. I hold your oath fulfilled. Be at peace. Oh. Uh, they're just gone now. Okay. Well, that kind of sucks because I feel like we, we'd still I feel like we could still use them because like okay what I was thinking is now that we've won this battle let's go straight to Mordor and just take that out while we're at it you know no did Mary die no Mary didn't die no way no way no way wait she really wait she died damn damn well, R.I.P. to her too huh? We lost a lot in this battle. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't even see her die. Like, it was super subtle. Like, she was talking to the king, the king died, and then, like, it cut away. It's like an aerial shot, right? I mean, when Mary stabbed the witch king, it definitely hurt him. So maybe when she was fighting him, she took damage from him too, and that's what killed her. So. Oh, she's not dead? What the fuck? Oh, okay, I guess she's not dead. Okay. Freaking pump tank, this right there. <laughs> But did Mary survive? It hasn't shown us him yet. Mary! Hmm. Yeah, Pippin's not stopping until he either finds a body or finds him alive. Mary, it's me. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's not dead. I knew you'd find me. Are you going to leave me? Fuck no. I'm going to look after you. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, they took all the webbing off, but they I guess they haven't noticed he has the ring on the necklace. Yep, his myth roll. That's mine! It's going to die, along with everything else. I don't take orders. Oh, yeah, he's not wearing. Oh, shit. They took it off. I don't think they realized that that's the one ring, though. Because, I mean, if they did, they would immediately take it to Sauron. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, these orcs are ruthless. <laughs> yeah, now they're all just gonna start fighting each other, though. <laughs> Sam. It's about to take out all three. <laughs> 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 
Damn, okay, Sam. Okay. Need you like a stuck pig. Mm, yep, Sam. Not if I stick you first. Sam! <laughs> Sam, I'm so sorry. Sorry for everything. They've taken it. They took the ring. Then we gotta go get it. Pardon, but they haven't. Mm, oh, what? Sam, did you sneak the ring off him? Oh, shit. I thought I'd lost you. So I took it. Damn. You snaked the ring off Frodo. Uh, Sam's like, he's not ready for the ring. He's not ready to hold the ring again. The ring is my burden. It'll destroy you, Sam. <laughs> they blend right in. Yep, okay, that's where they have, that's where they gotta get to, Mount Doom, right? We made it to Mordor. Mm-hmm. There's so many of them. We'll never get through unseen. Yeah. It's him. Yep. The eye. Well, if you put the ring on, you'll go unseen. Only one of you, though, but then he'll know you're literally right here, right? Frodo has passed beyond my sight. The darkness is... If Sauron had the ring, we would know it. He suffered a defeat, yeah. Behind the walls of Mordor, our enemy is regrouping. A thousand orcs now stand between Frodo and Mount Doom. Mm-hmm. There's still hope for Frodo. He needs time. Draw out Sauron's armies. Then we gather our full strength and march on the Black Gate. Hell yeah. We can give Frodo his chance if we keep Sauron's eye fixed upon us. Mm-hmm. See, this is why we should have kept the Army of the Dead. I mean, I get that they came through, but like, should have been like, look, I'll definitely free all of you, but like, I just need you for one more thing. <laughs> he will not take the bait. Oh, I think he will. Have a good sword on the CM. Long have you hunted me? Mm hmm. Come get me. No yep, show him. Behold the sword of Elendil. Is that Arwen? Did you show him Arwen? <laughs> yeah. Bro, he just fucking Udo reverse card him. <laughs> Ooh. All right, we're going though. I do not believe this darkness will endure. Hmm. I think that they should get together. Yes. Yes. I I love them together. Yes. Look, the orcs. They're moving off. Perfect. It's working. Again. Oh fuck, oh fuck. You should have stayed up. You should have stayed up the hill. Bro, don't have it. They're gonna see you. Be like, what are you doing here? Get in line, you know? And then. Oh, okay. They just. Alright, they're not gonna notice them? Okay. Yeah, this guy did. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, this is a bit of an issue. Oh, I love the nose rings, though. <laughs> Wait, for okay, Aragorn looks way different now. Like, this fool has a fresh cut, and it looks like he's growing a mustache now. So heavy. Mm -hmm. You're gonna notice they're not orcs. Mm -hmm. Hit me, Sam. Start fighting. Yeah, you literally just have to. Start a big scrum. Oh, okay, they got away. Cool. Come on, you gotta keep going. You're right there. You're so close. No, 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 no. I don't want to hear that. No, get up and go. Ah, yeah, it's the ring. It's such a way to carry. Mm -hmm. It's probably affecting him more that he's closer now, too. Like, the closer he gets, the more it affects him. The more it becomes a weight. 
Give the ring to Sam to carry. There's no point carrying anything we're not sure to need. Mm -hmm. Sam hasn't carried the Sam carried the ring for like such a short amount of time yet. He's still fresh, I would say. So I'd give him the ring for as long as we can with before like really starts to corrupt him. And then you, so Frodo can take a break, and then give it back to Frodo. If the fact that they're closer, it's affecting him more now, then it would probably just destroy Sam like that, you know. So probably not. Probably shouldn't do that then. I don't know. I've been none left for the return journey. I don't think there will be a return journey, Mr. Frodo. Yeah, this is a suicide mission. But if they don't die, and Aragorn and all of them win this war, they're about to fight. Then we'll just go home with them. Frodo, Ooh. Get down! Sauron the Great bids thee welcome. Tell your master this. The armies of Mordor must disband. He is to depart these lands, never to return. I have a token I was bidden to show thee. Hmm. Now they all think Frodo's dead. It's even more reason for them to fight. Go even harder now. The thought one so small would endure such pain. And he did, Gandalf. He did. Bro, you're just giving all of us even more, a greater reason to fight you, like. And who is this? Isildur's heir. Yep. It takes more to make a king than a broken elvish play. It's cause I'm like, <laughs> yes! <laughs> I saw him kind of turn his shoulder, and so I was like, cut his head off. And he did. I do not believe it. I will not. Mm -hmm. Unless you literally showed me his goddamn head, like holding him by his head, holding his head up, I would have no way they're believing it. Hold your ground! Hold your ground! Bro, imagine having the fight back to back battles like this. That'd be so taxing for all the soldiers in there. <sighs> I see in your eyes the same fear that would take the heart of me. A day may come. When the courage of men fails, take our friends and break all bonds of fellowship. But it is not this day. Mm -hmm. By all that you hold dear on this good earth, I bid you stand, men of the West! Hell yeah. That was a great shot of him holding up the sword. Bro, he's got me ready to fight. <laughs> Come on, Frodo, you're right there. Yes. Push, dig deep, Frodo, dig deep. Oh my god, we're surrounded. I well thought I'd die fighting side by side with an elf. What about side by side with a friend? Oh. I. I could do that. Yeah, we're we're a bit outnumbered too. Sam, drag his ass to the top. Drag his ass to the top. Do you remember the Shire, Mr. Furl? It'll be spring soon. Mm-hmm. Destroy this ring so we can get back. And the birds will be nesting in the hazel thicket. Don't forget where you came from. Don't forget what we're doing this for. I can't recall a taste of food. The sound of water. Yeah. Touch of grass. Nothing. No veil. Between me and the wheel of fire. I can see him. Mm. With my waking eyes. Then let us be rid of it. Once and for all. Come on, Mr. Frodo. I can't carry it for you. Mm. But I can carry you. Yep, exactly. Exactly. Damn, so de look at that determination in his eyes. Okay, no, that's still a pretty big. Okay, that's still like a good amount to go, but like, it's very close. But, but it's still a pretty, de it's still a pretty good hike. So, for 
Frodo. Mm-hmm. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. See, we're gonna win because we have more motivation to win. We want it more than they do. They're just fighting because they're told to fight. They're just born and then, okay, you're gonna fight, you know? They have decent motivation, but we have great motivation. The doorway. Mm. We're almost there. Oh, oh, <gasps> God. Oh my God, you motherfucker. How did you survive that fall? It happened like an hour ago in the movie. He lied. Oh, the precious! Smeagol promised! Smeagol lied. <laughs> Dude, um, Sam, fucking... Kid, you gotta kill Gollum. You gotta kill Smeagol. You gotta kill him. Yes, you gotta kill him. Oh, okay, I didn't kill him, but... Ooh. Go, Frodo, go! And you know, Sam shouts at him. Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh. Mm, what are you about to do? Oh. Eagles. Yeah, I was about to say, that's a fucking eagle. Okay, I'm here for it. Okay, I'm down. Eagles versus dragons. Okay. I'm here, Sam. Destroy it. Mm hmm Frodo, do it. Come on. I know it's not I know it's hard, but you have to. Throw it in the fire. What are you waiting for? Yeah. It's like he's hesitating. Just let it go. He can't. It's not that easy. <gasps> no, 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 no. The ring is mine. precious. Uh, okay, I thought he was gonna say precious. Oh my god. I got him. No! He knows immediately. Sip sending the Nazul there. Go get it. Go get it. Go. Watch. Gollum's gonna take the ring off his finger, and then Frodo's gonna like throw Gollum into the fire. Or into the lava. I mean, maybe not like throw him in there, but he'll like fall in there as a result of him trying to take the ring off. And Gollum will die with the ring. Call him it. Uh, oh, he just bit his, he just bit his whole finger off. Oh my god. Oh, I like the tip of it, but. Ah, yeah. Frodo, go kick him. Go kick him into the lava. <gasps> they both fucking fell. Oh. Oh. Is that, is it gonna? No? Okay, okay, he's holding on. But the ring, it like made a surface for it to sit on on top of the lava. Give me your hand! Watch them like they dropped it into like the wrong part, maybe. I don't know. Take my hand! No! He, d he doesn't have the fingers to like reach. Frodo, no, you're not. No, you're not. Don't you let go. 
Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay. Okay, the ring, the ring is destroyed, yeah. And Sauron can feel it, Sauron's in pain. Oh, is he about to explode? Why is it, why, why that giant just run away? Mm, oh, that's why, that's why. Kandalf's like, he did it. They did it. collapsing go 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 <laughs> bro everyone's gonna die like every oh i love how it stops exactly right there right for us okay and the, the volcano's exploding too so frodo and sam should be dead yeah because they were right up there Like, they all assume he's dead because they're in there. Okay, no, they're not. It's gone. We did it. It's done. Yes, Mr. Frodo. It's over now. Now you just gotta survive this. I can see the shot. Glad to be with you, Samwise Gamgee. Here at the end of all things. Mm. Oh, oh, the eagles are gonna come and pick him up. The eagles are gonna come and swoop. Gandalf's probably on one of them. Yeah, he is. <laughs> Yep, Frodo has no idea he's back. <laughs> yeah, it's been a really long time since Frodo has seen everyone. <laughs> kind of forget about that. Dude, they're basically like, like the amount of character development everyone has gone through since the end of the first movie is actually insane. <laughs> like since the last time Frodo saw all of them. Hmm. A little ceremony going on here. Now come the days of the king. Love to see it. King of Gondor. <laughs> This day does not belong to one man, but to all. Let us together rebuild this world. Wait, what's good with Arwen though? Like, I, I need to know. I need her to see him. I need her and Aragorn to see each other again before this movie ends. But I mean, we destroyed the ring, so she's not going to die as quickly now. But she's still going to die eventually. But like, I, I need them to see each other again before this movie ends. <laughs> There she is. <laughs> you bow to no one. Hell yeah. And the fellowship of the ring, totally bound by friendship and love, was ended. Mm. Found ourselves looking upon a familiar sight. The Shire. We were home. Must feel so good to just be at the Shire again. Like, damn. <laughs> damn, you married her? <laughs> Shit. And kids, too? I'm assuming we had a time jump. You begin to understand. There is no going back. 
finishing Bilbo's book. It's been four years to the day since where the top sat. It's never really healed. Hmm. The Hobbit's Tale by Bilbo Baggins and the Lord of the Rings, Lord of the Rings. by Frodo Baggins. By Frodo Baggins. You finished it. Mm-hmm. There's room for a little more. Bilbo's story was now over. There would be no more journeys for him. Tell me again, lad. Where are we going? A special honor. A place on the last ship to leave Middle Earth. Hmm. Any chance of seeing that old ring of mine again? <laughs> no. When I gave you? Nope. I'm sorry, Uncle. I'm afraid I lost it. <laughs> the power of the Three Rings is ended. Time has come for the dominion of men. I think I'm quite ready for another adventure. Oh, well. My mm. brave puppets. Comes the end of our friendship. Damn, this is a goodbye. <laughs> Not all tears are an evil. It is time, Rhoda. Is she coming with you? What does he mean? We set out to save the Shire, Sam. And it has been saved. But not for me. I don't mean that. Wow, well, you're ditching Sam. You can't leave. Yeah, I was about to say, he's leaving him the book to fill it in. Wow. Um. Dude, I'd be pissed if I was like, if I was Mary Pippin or Sam. Like, what the hell? But is it is he leaving because the ring affected him so much? Like, it still affects him, so like he he like can't stay. Damn. Your part in the story will go on. I'm back. All right. Well, that was the Lord of the Rings trilogy. All right, well that was Lord of the Rings and the Turn of the King and the and the Lord of the Rings trilogy. This is probably my favorite movie out of the entire trilogy, to be honest. I felt like this movie just had like the fastest pace. It had the most going on in it. It had the biggest climax out of all the movies. It had one really fat battle. The second battle towards the end of the movie, I mean like, I mean that was going to turn into like a pretty big battle right there, but you know, Frodo destroyed the ring, so it just stopped that. It stopped all of that, so. The second half of the movie was just like a, the fat, a fat ass climax. Like since um the battle of Gondor began till when Frodo destroyed the ring is like that's that's a that was a very long climax, but that was very entertaining. That was a really good climax to the movie. So honestly, I'm a little hurt that Gollum died. I liked his character, like I just I pitied him. I felt bad for him, you know, and then but I mean him dying with the ring, I feel like that's pretty solid. Like that's that's not bad at all. Like that was done really well. That was written very well. Lord of the Rings is a very well done, very well written story. I see why it's very popular. It's a great story. It has a very rich story and the lore is very deep and a lot of very interesting characters in it. Now I'm gonna be honest, is it my personal favorite? No. But does that mean it's not good? No, not at all. It's a fantastic story. I can totally see why people have this as their favorite trilogy or favorite as their favorite story, favorite franchise. I can totally understand why people would choose to have this as their number one favorite. But is it just my personal favorite? No. But I don't say that in like a way to take away from Lord of the Rings at all. Not at all. I hope that makes sense. I know you guys commented on the first movie that Lord of the Rings like, inspired literally pretty much everything that came after it. You know, and I, I saw it a lot within the second and the third movie. I noticed a lot of things I've seen in other movies. So obviously Lord of the Rings first inspired that and then other movies did the same thing later on. Did I mention them? No, not really because I did that in the first movie and I read the comments, so didn't do that in the second or third movie, but I, but I did notice them. I would say my favorite character out of the entire trilogy is definitely Aragorn. 
I liked him the most. I felt like he was the character I was interested in the most. And like, okay, I always thought like Frodo was the main character, but like, no, I feel like Aragorn is. I feel like it's a split between Aragorn and Frodo. You know, like the main storyline is Frodo getting to Mount Doom, but I feel like the main, the most developed character is Aragorn though. Like Frodo had a lot of character development too, but I feel like Aragorn had a little bit more character development. I felt like it focused on Aragorn just as much as it did Frodo. Maybe it didn't in terms of like screen time. Maybe Frodo had more screen time, but I don't know, just like from watching it, it just felt like Aragorn had more character development going on with him, you know? And maybe like maybe less screen time with Aragorn, but more development within his character. So he did feel like a main character. It felt like Aragorn was like 60 or like 55% the main character and Frodo was around like 40 to 45% the main character too. It was a split between them like 60 40 kind of if that makes sense. And, but then like every other character I really enjoyed a lot too like Gandalf, Gimli, the Hobbits, Legolas. I like Legolas a lot too. But yeah that was Lord of the Rings and the Return of the King. Comment down below what you thought about this movie down below in the comments and if you liked the video like the video. And thanks for watching.